Judah? Yes, big mama. Delki? Yes, big mama. How are you? I'm good. I'm not okay. What's wrong? No, I'm not okay. There are things running through my mind. Delki? Yes, ma'am. You care to share? Maybe, ma'am, I'll come to you one on one. Judah? Yes, big man. Delki? Yes, big man. How would you describe Saturday's live show? Uh. To me, it was a sad one seeing my friends leave. Jen, Joy, and Jessica. So, I was scary. It was sad. Because I really wanted them to be in the game and how genuine they were to most of us. Judah? Okay, big mama. So, for me, from the beginning, I got lost in the scene because I feel like I wasn't part of the whole uh, show at a point. And also, I was surprised seeing uh, Jessica and Droid got evicted because I, since I came into the house, I always look up to them as the best couples in the house. So they leaving was a bit surprise for me because uh, I realized but now it's not what you do in the house, but what you portray for people to love you. So that's what I've learned in my point of view on Friday, Saturday, sorry. Judah? Yes, big mama. They're okay? Yes, big mama. In your view, was it right for her niece to make such revelations about conversations that were had with her in confidence? <laughs> well, to be honest, I feel maybe she did what she did because maybe it has gotten to her here where she feel like it's too much. I can't blame her, but she did what she did. Because at the end, she just uttered everything. Because she kept saying it in the house that there are certain things, if we all hear about what she has said, you should be surprised. It's like putting people in suspense, and now she just uttered it at once there. So maybe because of how she felt about the whole thing. Judah? Big Mama. Okay, to me, uh, I feel like for me, if it were to be me, I will confront everybody personally, but rather seeing it on stage because 
there are certain things is very harsh and you know although it's not right to say things if i don't know if it's true or not but saying those things on stage i don't think it's right for me though I will confront the people directly than saying it to the public. Belki? Yes, Mama. You had a banter with Tessie? Yeah. Has this affected your friendship? Yes. Yes. It does, because she, she was not even talking to me before the eviction. I tried her to go closer to her. She was not. She was not. Because she did something on that Saturday morning, even Friday. I overlooked it. Saturday morning, she did again. And even, even me that I was supposed to be pleased, I just tried to forget it because I felt like you do this every time and you come to me and be like, I'm your friend now, I'll, I'll be the one to understand you. You can't always do something to hurt me and you always say that. You are rather breaking me down. So I was pleased that Saturday morning, but I still forget and I was still coming close to her. She was not even minding me. Then I'm like, wow. And even the reunion time, I if I was taking mic from her. Called her several times, she didn't mind before she handed the mic and it looks like <laughs> Mom, I'm shaking. I can't even talk. That's fine. They're okay. Yes, my mama. Is there a chance for reconciliation with Tessie? Please come again. Is there a chance for reconciliation with Tessie? My, even yesterday, I discussed with um, Judah to help me, like, let's tell um, Martin so that maybe we all sit down or probably tell you so that maybe you organize something for her so that at least I can talk to her and tell her my feelings. And if she has something to tell me, she tells me. But then again, something happened in the evening, and I went to Judah again, and I'm like, you see, she said this again. I felt bad. At that moment, I wanted to cry, but I overlooked it, and he was like, it's good that I did that. And... Judah? Yes, big mama. How do you feel about Delki's issue with Tessie? Uh, it's a difficult one, and I think I don't feel comfortable with it because when I came into the house, they are more like a sister, so it's like one family. So I also took Tessie as my sister. So things happening like this, I feel like I'm in between two sisters and I don't know how to, you know, go about the whole issue. So it's worrying me a lot and I just want to find a way and bring them back together as how they are from the beginning since I came into the house. Judah? 
Judah? Yes, Big Mama. What would you advise her do? Please come again. What would you advise Delki do? I think she should just... Uh, if she is wrong or not, she just apologize and pretend like nothing happened. And if she will accept or not, she just come back as friends. So I think that's the only way. Or either both of them talk about their differences and know who is wrong and not and accept their mistakes and come back as friends again. So yesterday we were trying to uh, talk to you if you can organize a, something like a, a dinner for uh, both of them. Either Martin and Tessie mm -hmm. and Delki and I, or Delki and Tessie, so that they can have a deep conversation, you know, as a sister. So I think that's my suggestion. Judah? Yes, Big Mama. Delki? Yes, Mama. How would you describe the mood in the house now? <laughs> Pretense, fake, and act. Mm. <coughs> I think there is a division in the house. So. But for me, I just, I love everybody and I try to play cool with everybody. So for me, I don't have any issue with no one. So, but aside that, what happened during the reunion makes me know that there is a division, clear division in the house. But for me, I just have to play with the rules, the rules and regulations in the house and just be okay with everybody. Okay. Oh, I see. Okay. Go. Okay. Okay. Please. Go on. Okay. So me, all I see is pretense, fake, and acting. Like your act, whereby it's no, everything is not real. Based on relationship and friendship. Everything. Everything. They're okay. Yes, mama. I would find time for the one on one you're asking for. So yes, I'll make see. it happen. Yes, please. For now, this ends your session. Thank you for coming in. Thank you very much. Thank you, big.